video, I'm going to show you how to create a subscription button from your PayPal account. So to get started, log into your PayPal account, go to Tools and All Tools, and you'll be on this page. Select PayPal Buttons. Correction, select Recurring Payments. And then on this side, select Create a Subscription Button. On this page, this is a wizard setup, and all you need to do is just go through step by step. So with the first part, choose a, a buy button type, it will be subscriptions, and you can put in the name of your product. The subscription ID is optional, and choose your currency. In the next part, you may customize your button any how you want, and if you already have your own button image, select this radio button and put in the address of your uh, image. Alternatively, you may leave this alone. In the next part, you may put in the number or the amount for your billing uh, cycle. So let's just say I would like to charge $19.95 every month. So it's going to be $19.95 USD, billing cycle, one month. And after how many cycles should the billing stop? If this is forever, then it's never. Alternatively, if there is a limit to the subscription, you may put a number, let's say, a 12 month installment, then you can lift this at 12 months. So this billing will be going for $19.95 a month, every month for 12 months. If you would like to offer a trial period, you may take this box and do just that. Next part is step two. Leave the options alone. This allows you to save the button and edit later. Then step three, you may customize your checkout page. You may request for your customer's postal address, and if this is not needed, you can click no. And then the next part is take customers to this URL when they cancel their checkout. If you have a cancellation page, you may take this and put the address. But the most important thing is that you have to take this box, take customers to this URL when they finish checkout, and put in the address of the website where they're going to see after making the payment. So, of course, this is just an example, but this should be your proper website uh, address. So once you're done, click Create button. And now you're given a website or an email version where you can paste this code onto your web, pack, uh, web page or e-commerce store, and you have a Buy button that is on a subscription basis.